Namaste. Due to current situation, many people want to stay in ashram for lifelong. I am getting comments. Some women, some men and single uh, women or girls or many people want to stay lifelong in an ashram and they want to want a peaceful life. And asking which ashram can give them a lifelong stay, including stay, food, and everything, you know. So, in olden days, ashram used to be a spiritual center, and there are many kings they used to give donation. So, they used to give this ashram was focused on spirituality and teaching of spiritual things. But nowadays, there is no fund which support ashrams other than donations from people. So anywhere if you stay without donation, they may not accept you. Otherwise, you have to do some seva. So you will indirectly become a free labor for them. Free labor means they will cut down the cost of running the ashram. So if you want to stay in ashram, you have to do seva in such a way they get they have to get impressed like you you are you are literally like you are really surrendered to the ashram management and doing what they say so in, in by that they 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 cut down their cost of running the ashram plus there is some spiritual practices make maybe they will teach you yoga meditation otherwise like a bhakti yoga or karma yoga or different different things are there each ashram teach you different thing so this ashram will provide you such things for free so some ashrams there are some courses so that you have to do to enter the ashram for example isha yoga center shri shri ravashankar's ashram uh, in bangalore or in isha yoga center sadguru's ashram in koyamuttur they have course like uh, inner engineering if you do inner engineering and there is another course uh, after that they allow you to stay in ashram and volunteer there in sri sri ravi shankar's ashram you have to do like there is one course like um, sudarshan kriya so if you do sudarshan kriya they will allow you to stay in ashram and they allow you to volunteer there for limited time in that limited time if you impress them, they may allow you to stay for long. So there is no such thing like a lifelong because we are also temporary people and whatever is you see around us is a temporary thing. So even ashram may get closed. For example, Beetle Ashram in Rishikesh, in Haridwar also there are many ashrams, they got closed. So in between, they may get closed and you don't know where to go next. Because you don't have financial freedom, you don't have backup, because you left your house for the ashram and surrendered there. So, there is no space for you. I recommend you to make money and make a base where you can come and come back and stay. Otherwise, by joining a ashram for lifelong, if by if, who knows if ashram itself get closed like ashram ji bapu ashram in ahmedabad there are many ashrams of ashram ji bapu they got closed they are not running there many people used to stay but now they don't know where to go and many people left the ashram started working again imagine you are 60 plus years old and ashram got closed what you will do so for that i recommend you to make a base for you like a home or something then you think about ashram if you are youngster you better get a job and be a financial free at least for your food and stay if you are a single woman you have to go to ashram and check the ashram properly because up for the safety and all and there are some women with children who want to stay in ashram in some ashram they provide free education for the kids also. For example, Siddhagiri Mat in uh, Kolapur, Maharashtra is also called as a Kanari Mat. 
so they have vedic school there are many different ashram they are having their own schools where you, where you can send your kids and volunteer in ashram so there are many ashrams before that i want you to become uh, financially free that is my view you don't have to agree but please comment below and let me know your views on this long term stay in a ashram you know permanent stay is it really possible or what is this if you have experience staying in a ashram please comment below if you know any ashram please comment below and help others and subscribe this channel and get in touch with me thanks for watching namaste